What's up guys, I'm making a video on how to install the CLR browser plugin for OBS. Um, some of you guys didn't know how to install it and that's kind of my fault I got I didn't show you guys so here's the open broadcast software this is where the CLR browser plugin is and I will provide it in the description again uh, make sure you find out if you have 32-bit or 64-bit to know how you have that is it goes by the RAM of your uh, memory like the gigabyte RAM uh, I have four gig or I have eight gigabytes so I have 64-bit I think it's for over four gigabytes or four gigabytes period it's 64-bit and anything below four gigabytes is 32-bit so what you what I did was is I downloaded the 64-bit when I downloaded the 64-bit this is what it looks like when you open it and you need WinRAR to open it okay here's what you do after you have OBS installed go to your hard disk this mine C go down to program files now okay let's back this up here if you have 32 bit you want to click 86 86 is still the same as 32 and OBS will be in here see it's I have 32 bit and 64 bit so it's right here um, we're gonna go to program files which is my 64 bit and uh, OBS will be right there um, you want to install CLR browser in the plugins folder see go back click plugins this is where you will install it. Your CLR host plugin, the folder, you will drag over into the plugins. Just drag it somewhere where it's empty, like kind of like that. Like somewhere don't don't put it over any top over in, uh top of any of this stuff here or cuz it'll mess it all up. And then the CLR host plugin .dll, you want to stick somewhere empty in the folder too. So it shows up down here as you can tell in my plugins folder I have CLR host plugin right here and here's the host plugin dot DLL it's all right here so that's how you install it and if anybody else has any problems or uh, needs any help let me know but I hope that helped you guys out and subscribe comment leave a message like all that good stuff so alright that's all see you guys later